York's annual Fist Fest, the Golden Gloves is highlighted by whirlwind action in the 175-pound sub-novice class. Sal Valentoni goes down right after the opening bell with Dick Johnson on the firing end. The leather keeps flying all during round one, and Valentoni, wearing the white, is consistently on the receiving end. No one can deny his game. He's giving his all for the New York Daily News Welfare Fund. They sponsor these bouts for charity. But Johnson shows no charity for Bellantoni. In one minute and six seconds of the second round, Bellantoni is down again, this time for good. It's Johnson by a TKO. Charlie Gale gets bounced to the canvas early by Robin Laborde. But here's another boxer who doesn't know the meaning of quit. Laborde has his measure, though, and drives Charlie right out of the ring. Gale manages to get back in the scene of action, but he should have stood in a ringside seat. He gives his all, but Robin is too much for him. In 31 seconds of the third round, Gale is blown out of action by Robin Laborde. Louis Belletta, he's wearing the white sneakers, and Raphael Schwartz get together, and they seem to be tilting at windmill. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? The crowd laughs it up, but who can deny they're not trying? The clock reads one minute and 13 seconds of the first round as Schwartz calls it a night. So Louis Belletta moves ahead in the golden gloves. Let's hope he didn't catch cold from the roundhouse misses. <laughs> 